Before we begin, please hit subscribe button to receive updates. This procedure to remove stop or DJVU ransomware and possible file recovery tutorial video consists of three stages. 1. Things to do before removing the ransomware virus. 2. Removing the ransomware virus using anti-malware and antivirus tools. 3. Possible decryption or file recovery using different options. Here are some important things you must do before removing STOP or DJVU ransomware virus. Do not connect any important backup drives on the infected computer. Make a backup copy of all the encrypted files, including the ransom note and relevant data to a clean media. If there is a need to modify system data like hosts file or Windows registry, please make an effort to do a backup first. After downloading the recommended antivirus and anti-malware scanner, please disable Wi-Fi or internet connection. Isolate the computer to avoid infecting other devices. Download malware bytes from the official website. Click the link below to go to the website. Open the downloaded application. Then, install Malwarebytes with the default settings. Once fully installed, click on Get Started button. If you want complete protection, click Buy Now, otherwise click on Maybe Later to use the trial version. Do not scan the computer yet. Please close Malwarebytes another window. At this point System Restore is already compromised. So, we will need to deactivate System Restore. Please follow these steps. Go to Windows Taskbar and search System Protection. Click on Create a Restore Point from the results. Choose the Windows Installation Drive. Then, click on Configure. Select Disable System Protection. After that, click on Delete to remove all contaminated restore points. Click Apply and then click OK. Next, we will need to reboot the computer in safe mode. To do this please do the following. First go to Windows Start search box and type msconfig. Then, click the system configuration. Click on the boot tab and click on safe boot. Then, select minimal from the choices. Click on the Apply button and then click the OK button. Finally, Windows will prompt for Computer Restart. Please click on Restart button.
After booting in safe mode, we will clean the Windows host's file. Open File Explorer. Then go to C Drive. Then open Windows folder. Open System32 folder. Then open Drivers folder. Finally, open ETC folder. Double click on Hosts file to open. Choose Notepad as an application to open the file. Once you open the hosts file, find the suspicious entries and delete them. Save the file and close notepad. We will also need to delete malicious startup items. Go to Windows Start search box. Then type Run. Click on Run from the result. On the Run field dialog box type Shell colon Startup. On Startup window, select all the malicious items. Delete the selected files to remove them from Startup. Then, close the current window. We will need to scan the computer to remove any viruses. Open Malwarebytes Scanner. Click the Scan button. Scanning the computer will take a while. Please wait for this scan to complete. After the scan, delete all identified viruses. Do not restart the computer yet. Close Malwarebytes window. Finally, we will remove the safe mode to start Windows normally. Go to Windows Start search bar. Type MS Config and select System Configuration from the results. Click on the Boot tab. Please uncheck on the Safe Boot option. Click on Apply and then click OK. Click the Restart button to reboot Windows in normal mode. You may run additional scan after restarting the computer to ensure that no more virus is left on the computer. Although ransomware is one kind of file encrypting virus that is difficult to decipher, there are still ways to recover files affected by this threat. Hence there is no guarantee that the procedures will yield to 100% recovery of files. As always, there are no one-size-fits-all for the ransomware attack. These recovery procedures may work for some but others may be not be lucky to find this useful. To proceed with the file recovery please click the link below to go to the website. Once you open the website, navigate to the Stop or DJVU file recovery section. First option is the dedicated Stop DJVU decryption software that works for older versions. Next is to find if there are available decryption software for recent versions of Stop DJVU ransomware. Another option is to use the Windows version tool. And lastly, you can try Shadow Explorer to recover files from the computer. There is no harm in trying these options because you don't have to pay anything. Good luck! Again, please hit the subscribe button below if you haven't done yet.